Hello, and welcome to the Professor Chaz preview of Harry Potter Places Book 4, Newts. No, we're not referring to the nastily exhausting wizarding tests. Harry Potter Places Book 4 is all about Northeastern England wizarding treks. Northeastern England is where you'll be able to visit the real-life Hogwarts Express and get a glimpse at the Weasley's Blue Flying Ford Anglia. You'll find a few of these fantastic flying cars around and about the village of Gothland on the gorgeous North Yorkshire Moor. A few miles away in the town of Durham is the real-life site of Professor McGonagall's classroom and the tower where Dumbledore met his death. Harry Potter Places Book 4 will lead you on a remote and rugged trek to relive Harry, Ron, and Hermione's Horcrux hunting days, including the distinctive limestone pavement campsite atop Malham Cove, a spot deep within the Yorkshire Dales National Park. But one place a true Potterite cannot miss in northeastern England is Annick Castle. No other Harry Potter Places film site has so enthusiastically embraced and accommodated Harry Potter fans. At Annick Castle, you can take a broomstick flying lesson, pose for pictures with Potter costumed characters, or go on a battle axis to broomsticks tour. If you're pottering about in northeastern England, you simply must plan a visit there. Harry Potter Places Book 4 will have you dazzled by the dizzying heights of Durham Cathedral's central tower, moseying to the very edges of Malham Cove, and greeting trains at Hogsmeade Railway Station. Thank you for visiting my classroom today. Join us for the next Professor Chaz Chat where we'll introduce you to Harry Potter Places Book 5, Scotland, Hogwarts Home, and Happy Pottering.